Okay. What I'm going to do today is graft a Honeycrisp bud onto this rootstock. And the result will be a branch that grows out from it that becomes a Honeycrisp tree. This little piece of branch I collected the other day from a full-sized Honeycrisp tree. You want to cut this year's growth. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a T-shaped cut uh, on the trunk of this tree, the rootstock, and I'm going to cut off a bud from this bud stick, we call it, and insert that into the T-shaped little cutout in the bark, and then wrap it all up with grafting tape. I'm going to do it on the north side of the tree. It's supposed to be better because it uh, goes away from the, the sun on the south, and it doesn't dry out as fast. So the first step is to cut the top of the T, maybe about close to halfway around the circumference is about the right amount. We're going to cut down to make the, the stem of the T. Now I'm going to open it up. Ready? Like that. Cut it. Okay. There will be a little bit of wood in here that you want to just flick out. There we go. Okay. You don't want to touch the, the inside of the, the bark there. Slide it right down in there. This is parafilm grafting tape. Maybe six inches of tape or so. That's good enough. Stretch and wrap. Okay, for the best. Next spring, right now it's it's August. You can do this in July and August. Um, next spring, hopefully, a little bud will grow out of not this this stem. This stem will fall off, but behind there is next year's bud, and the Honeycrisp tree will start to grow out of there. And as that, as that starts to grow, you want to clip off the rest of this rootstock. And, I mean, you could clip it off right there, but what some people do is they'll, they'll maybe clip off these, these growths and leave a little section here. And that way, as this shoot comes up, you have something to kind of tie it to, to keep it to go, going straight. Honeycrisp.